Hello welcome to our YouTube channel Science Facts. If you are new to our channel then please subscribe and press the bell icon for more updates. Today we are going to know some important dates and discoveries of ancient world. 2nd century BC The Hellenistic astronomer and philosopher Seleucus of Seleucia supports Aristarchus's heliocentric theory and links the tides to the influence of the moon. 2nd century AD The Roman Egyptian mathematician and astronomer Ptolemy, Claudius Ptolemius, describes a geocentric model, largely based on Aristotelian ideas, in which the planets and the rest of the universe orbit about a stationary Earth in circular epicycles, which becomes the scientific orthodoxy for nearly two millennia, essentially until Copernicus in the 16th century. He also details the complex motions of the stars and planetary paths using equants, allowing astronomers to predict the positions of the planets. 3rd century BC The Greek astronomer and mathematician Aristarchus of Samos is the first to present an explicit argument for a heliocentric model of the solar system, placing the Sun, not the Earth, at the center of the known universe. He describes the Earth as rotating daily on its axis and revolving annually about the Sun in a circular orbit, along with a sphere of fixed stars. 2nd century BC The Greek astronomer Hipparchus of Nicaea makes the first measurement of the precession of the equinoxes and compiles the first star catalogue in which he proposes our modern system of apparent magnitudes. He also improves on the solar system model of Apollonius of Perga, in which an eccentric circle carries around a smaller circle, an epicycle, which in turn carries around a planet. 3rd century BC The Stoic philosophers of ancient Greece assert a kind of island universe in which a finite cosmos is surrounded by an infinite void, similar in principle to a galaxy. 3rd century BC The Greek mathematician and geographer Eratosthenes proved that the Earth was round and made a remarkably accurate calculation of its circumference and its tilt, as well as devising a system of latitude and longitude and, possibly, estimating the distance of the Earth from the Sun. If you like and find this video helpful then subscribe this channel and like this video and don't forget to press the bell icon.